Hi, this short video shows an interesting enclosure for the Pi. It's low cost and it's also unusual because it provides a lot of space for inserting your own custom functionality. The design is intended for industrial use on a DIN rail inside control panels, but even for non-industrial use the case could be used as is whenever a decent enclosure is needed for trying out some functionality. In normal use inside the control panel or wiring cabinet, the case is a front panel that can be drilled out for buttons and displays, and internally PCBs can be fitted with custom functions, and there's also room for push fit wire plugs and sockets as well. The case is space for an optional bus connection too, for attaching electrically to the next device on the DIN rail. To speed up development, a custom PCB template has been created in Eagle, but it can be exported to other systems too. It will allow circuits to perfectly fit the enclosure, and then the Pi can plug on top of it. Anyway, even without the additional PCB, the case is very useful. It comes with a couple of carrier rails that snap onto the Pi and serve as locators to precisely position it into the case. The most used connections on the Pi are exposed, as is the slot for the micro SD card. The least used connectors like the audio, video and the micro USB power are available internally and there is space to bring out those wires. Once you've done that and put it inside, then the rear case snaps on, there are clips which hold it into place. It's very easy to di disassemble later as many times as needed. Another cool thing is that if you require access to the connections on the Pi, you can do it by assembling a ribbon cable. Connect up to the cable to the Pi and then the cable can remain inside the enclosure or brought out to either side. There is lots of flexibility there. The micro SD card is hard to remove from the outside since it is a pull to remove holder on the Pi rather than a push to remove, but if there is a need for the end user to be able to remove the card then a bit of tape solves that issue. I used captain tape here. Be careful when removing the Pi from the case not to snag on the micro SD card. Thanks for watching.